Typical Calgary oh. winter. There you, you go. You never know what you're going to get. Thanks very much, Andy. And time to head on out to Mike Yanni this morning, who's in Northwest Calgary at Co op this morning. And Mike, you're navigating the grocery store with the help of technology. Yeah, you know, I'm really surprised, guys, to find out how much stuff is local uh, within Calgary Co op. But take a look at this. Uh, this surprised me. Do you guys know what this is? Let's see. Uh, watermelon. Any idea? It looks like a watermelon. No, that's a pretty ugly hybrid. watermelon. A gourd. Uh, it is. A tuber. It, it, it's a kabacha <laughs> squash. This was grown in Lethbridge. Oh. Uh, and I guess you, what you do is you cut it open, you stuff it full of brown sugar, and you bake it. Sounds pretty tasty. But and who butter. knew stuff like that in butter? Uh, who knew though stuff like that here is grown uh, all within a couple hours in the city? That's the amazing thing about localize. It really does open up your eyes to see what is available in local stores. And Ron with Calgary Co-op, that's incredible. This is just a small sample of the localized products right here in Calgary Co-op. Yeah, absolutely. We carry over a thousand items in our store, and we believe in supporting the local growers and local producers. It's a key component of what we do when we listen to our members. It's all part of uh, our initiative of being a local company. Now, you guys teamed up with Localize a couple of years ago, and what have, the, what have the customers said to you since that? Well, I think the important part is they're obviously reacting very well with it in the aspect that uh, the sales of this products are over $26 million now. Since we launched this initiative, we have seen uh, growth of over 10% in the sales, so this is all very, very encouraging as to where we're going as a company and as a local uh, provider to our customers. And of course, more and more products are continuously being added to the localized line. Absolutely, we look at every, every day. We look at what can what's the potential of these products and what can we uh, satisfy our customer base with, and look to get them in our stores as quick as possible. And I know I saw Megan uh, this morning already looking at the aisle saying, oh, wait a minute, I didn't have that in the database. It's continuous, right? Always updating. Yeah, so we're always looking for more local products. Sometimes they show up on store shelves and we're like, oh, my gosh, we got to localize that. And sometimes we're trying to introduce more local products into these stores so that more producers and processors have more opportunities. So where do you take the company from here? You've been around for three and a half years, but it really seems like you're on that verge of just exploding. Well, what we want to see is continued growth of the local economy uh, around Calgary and in Alberta. We've actually grown our program throughout Western Canada in over uh, 300 retails now, and we just started a team in Toronto to try to bring this out east. So you're expanding as well? We are. And it seems like a lot of the companies talking to this morning, the fact partnering up with Localize helps them out expand their companies, getting the word out that they're local. Yeah, absolutely. And I think there's a really uh, natural thing that happens here. So producers partner with us, they share some information, and their shoppers really value that. And when they see the Localize information, then they, they, they buy more of those products, and that's really important. How many products do you think are in the database right now? So we have about 10,000 products. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, so there's tons of local food and local businesses here in Alberta and across Canada. It's really about bringing uh, some clarity to who those guys are and how we can support them better. Well, it's been a very eye-opening morning here at Calgary Co-op using Localize and your smartphone to be able to track down where the products come from and get that backstory. And I think that's probably the coolest part is finding out uh, the story behind the companies that are bringing these products to our, our dinner tables every night. Ted, Jill? Great, Mike. Yeah, and why not? You were saying if you have the option to choose local or